In this video I will compare Klaviyo versus Yappo and tell you which of these e-commerce tools is best for you and why. So first, what exactly do they do? So Yappo is basically a tool that will basically help you get more orders from every single customer through point systems, referral programs and subscriptions. On top of that, it will also help you with email and SMS marketing. Now next to those marketing tools, you can also collect reviews and UGC. Now comparing this to Klaviyo, we can see on Klaviyo's website what they do here. They will help you set up email marketing, SMS marketing, mobile push notifications, also collect reviews, set up web forms, they have an AI, and you can collect customer data to get a good overview of who your customer base is. Now in terms of integrations, Klaviyo does have a lot more integrations with e-commerce platforms. So here you will see a few of them, for example Shopify, Wix, WooCommerce and BigCommerce. Now comparing this to Yappo's integrations, if we scroll to the bottom of this page and here click on integrations and then here let's select e-commerce platforms you will see it only has seven integrations with e-commerce platforms. Now, some of the major ones such as Shopify, WooCommerce, BigCommerce are in here, but many major e-commerce platforms are not actually available on Yappo. For example, Wix is not included right here. So if you are running your e-commerce business on Wix, then I would go with Klaviyo since it's not available on Yappo. So you can see on Klaviyo's integration page, if we click e-commerce platforms, there are 64 results. So Klaviyo will integrate with pretty much every single e-commerce platform that you may be using. So most of these by far are not included on Yappo. So that's something to keep in mind. Just go and see if the platform that you are actually selling on is included on both of these. And if it's not, then automatically you want to go and pick the other one. So first, before I give you a conclusion, let's go ahead and compare their pricing. So you can see Klaviyo has a free plan for up to 500 monthly email sends and 150 free monthly SMS credits. Then after that, it depends on how many contacts you have. For example, if you have 5,000 active profiles, then the email plan is $110 per month for 55,000 monthly email sends, which is 11 emails per subscriber which is more than enough. Then you have email and SMS at $125 per month for the same amount of active profiles and monthly email sends. But then here you can also choose how many SMS credits you want. For example, if you want 5,000, then the price goes up to $155 per month. Now comparing this to Yappo's pricing, you can see that it kind of depends on what you want. So you have the full product suite right here where you will get access to everything. You can build your bundles so you can choose what you want. For example, email, then here enter how many emails you want to send. And then you can just build your own bundle. But if you want everything right here, you will see this is pretty expensive. The pro plan here costs $828 per month, then premium $1201 for a monthly order volume of just $3. Now let's say that you have 10,000, then you will see it starts at $1,300. Now if you just want one of these, such as SMS and email, then you will see SMS is 0 0.0072 per SMS, which is quite cheap, and the emails are $160 per month for 125,000 emails. But if you just get this, then I would personally just go with Klaviyo, since in that subscription you will also get reviews, and web forms and a bunch of other stuff. So who should go with Yappo? I think you should go with Yappo if you have a pretty established e-commerce brand and you're really looking to increase the average order value and the average amount of money that a customer spends in their lifetime on your brand. So for example, if they order once and you really want them to order again, that is what Yappo is really good for because it will help you set up point systems where people can, for example, collect points on their order and then use those points to redeem a discount on their next order. You also can set up referral programs and stuff like that. So for those kind of things, Yoppo is really good. Although it is quite expensive, therefore I would only use it if you have an established e-commerce brand. Then I would use Klaviyo if you have a smaller e-commerce brand or if the platform you're selling on is only included in Klaviyo and you're just looking for a bit of a more affordable tool compared to Yoppo. Since even if you have say 10,000 contacts, then Klaviyo is a lot cheaper than Yoppo. Now if you want to get started with Klaviyo completely for free, if you click on the link in the description it will take you to this page of Klaviyo where you can try the top email and SMS marketing tool completely for free 
without adding any payment details. So click on the link in the description to get started with Klaviyo for free. And I'll also leave a link to Yotpo down in the description. And through that link you can just go and build your own bundle and then contact them to get their help in setting it up for you. So that concludes this comparison of Klaviyo versus Yotpo. If this comparison was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.